what the hell is wrong with my game? Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Terraria The Stars Above. Now, yes, it has been a while and I've done a crap ton of stuff off camera. I'll go through all of that, but first... Um... Yeah. I have done a crap ton of stuff off camera. Including beating Skeletron Prime. What? Um, he appeared out of nowhere and I beat him with like pre mech boss gear. I mean, I wasn't even that prepared, but I have made some improvements. I'll go over all of it, but first, I'm gonna show you the Skeleton Prime fight, so enjoy. And now, now that that's covered, well, I've done a bit more building as well, as you can see. This is, like, the world, and then I've, I'm making, basically, the planets that I've been to, like, connected to. So, obviously, it'd be like a, a web, like a web of planets, almost. Now, um, Spatial Disk also has some... Oh, I need your assistance. This is the Unsullied Canvas. It will draw the Witch of Ink. The Witch of Ink, out of hiding. Please prepare yourself, this, this will be a hard fight. Okay, uh... Okay, so I need to keep that. When is that done? The Witch of Ink. Oh my god, it's after Skeleton Prime, no wonder. <laughs> I've got Queen Slime, Twins Destroyer first. Which I will do the Queen Slime today, guaranteed. Because, obviously, yeah. Now, I've also made the Neo Pursuant High Guard Armor, which is melee. Uh, it, it just requires this, so if I go into the Neon Telemetry, obviously the dual shield, and then you've got the head booster. Each set has their own unique set bonus, so there you go. Um, yeah, we've got the Neo Pursuant Plasteel. It's just using Palladium and Neon Telemetry, which is a drop from the new Biome in Hell. There you go. Um, i got the Gossamer Needle. Which is this. Obviously, Essence, Essence of Hollow Nest. I got that um, a few episodes ago. Or maybe last episode. 
And then the Carlin True Silver. Using that, an Essence of the Silver Ash. Got that last episode, I believe. Um, so, yeah. Um, also, I think I got the Steel Spark Boosters. Or whatever they are, sneakers. My bad. Requires Flurry Boots, Frog Gear, and Bundle of Horseshoe Balloons. Which means I've actually taken my Terra Spark Boots off. That is correct. I've also gotten a yo-yo bag as well. Because, you know, yo-yo on top. Oh, wait. More. Melee. Oh. What? Did I just hear multi-power suit? Huh? What? Oh, shoot. Oh, it's hallowed bars. Wait, don't I have hallowed bars? I, I beat Skeletron, bruh. Oh, so this, this must be like a buffer kind of thing? Like um, a buffing weapon? Oh, God. Okay, let's just... Oh, it's godly as well. Cheers. Oh, wait, no, it's not. Oh, my God. The range on that. Whoa, okay, I've right-clicked. Whoa. Okay, the green. Oh, my God, that's like a freaking Vortex beater. Okay. Then I'm Doomfist. And they see, and they see, and they see, and they see. Um, well, we are going to try the Queen Slime now. So, you're going to get rapid two boss fights. Um... I just got rid of my arena platform builder. I'm silly, so... Yeah, I mean... Let's just get into the fight, I suppose. In three, two, one. And there we go. Lovely jubbly. Thank you very much, Queen Slime. Thank you indeed. Ah, well, I don't actually know what the Queen Slime can really give. Uh, what does this armor do? Or is it just... Well, it's probably not as good as mine. Also, yes. Um, with regards to the Stella Nova, I changed it. Yes, that is right. I did change it. Uh, if you basically go... Hang on. Essence of what now? Did I just see Essence of Mew? Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Essence of Mew, okay. Orbital ex... Hang on. Is this a Star Rail reference? Oh my god! <laughs> I swear! Hang on a minute. Oh, this weapon exudes property to both melee, okay. Depends how you swing it, I suppose. Oh. Magic. That's that. Queen Slime is defeated. It doesn't even make any sense to Slime. I seriously think... I just don't think Slime has the capacity to think. Who knows? Maybe they're smarter than us. Then again, I'd be really annoyed if my intelligence was dwarfed by some gelatin. Another step forward. Range type weapon. So that's still being or not this magic weapon. Another step forward. Uh, summon weapon. Melee lance. Oh, God. Ranged. Oh my goodness me. Melee weapon. Five different forms. Okay. Let's keep going. Okay. What do you need? In terms of... Because I'm pretty sure... Oh, hang on. Yes. Yes, I have. Um, I'm pretty sure, right, I can upgrade this now? It's tier 2 Stellar Glyph. Oh, I could have, like... Oh my god, I could have ages ago. Well, yeah, let's upgrade that as well. So, what, we need Xenoblade and Hull Bro. Hull. <laughs> Hull. Hull Rot. And Xenoblade. 
Zenlo, Xenoblade. Okay, here we go. These two weapons. Let's have a looky. Okay, I can't. Can I not? What? Hello? Oh. Oh, okay. This isn't supposed to. This isn't how it's supposed to work because of this exalted hilt. Oh my god. I've got a freaking. I've got a particle beam. That might be broken, you know. And then a whole rot. Oh my god, it it does it as well. Oh, it's like a oh, it's like a swinging weapon. Okay, right click to swap between blasting form and striking form. So blasting form. Oh my god, it acts as a gun. It does act as a gun. I'm very interested to see how things will be when I've literally got the northern lights coming out of my weapons. <laughs> Hang on a minute. Um. Let's just do the Queen Slime again. I really want to test something here. Alright, we're here. Queen Slime. Oh! <laughs> oh my god! Oh no! What have I done? What have I done? What have I done? Oh no! Oh no! Oh god! <laughs> oh no, guys! It's cool, but I prefer my needle. And also the fact that that kind of breaks it. I mean, I will. I am. I am getting rid of it. There's no way I'm using that. I'm sorry. Um. Maybe I can put my friggin' Terra Spark boots back on, I guess. Alright, so next up on the agenda is this. The Ancient Master's Map of the Lost King's Great Ancestor. This reveals the entire map. If you just do that, wait for a second, boom. The reason why I've done this is because I wanted to find you. I have never been to the Shimmer before. I think it's about time I visited. Now, the only problem is I don't know what uh, I can do. I don't know what I can shimmer because I've never been before. Okay, the Celestriad route awaits. With the Stellar Glyph, Tier 2, baby. Can I make Tier 3? Tier 3? Bandit Tenebrium. What? Is that... Is that from the Neon Veil? Vale? Who are those guys? Ooh! More stuff. Some type essence will create a controllable okay, drone. Let's keep going. The thing is, though, this might be actually really underpowered. Yeah, it is because I got it. I've I've left the stellar glyph too long. Okay, um, I guess let's just get into some exploring some new worlds because Jesus Christ. Sorry, nothing to comment on right now. You rang. Okay, so we're on the menu. Tier 2 Stellar Glyph. For example, tu Tukana. Jungle. Serpens. Cor it's like a corruption world. Corvus. Uh, War Torn Ashen Planet. You know what? I love War Torn stuff. Unique upgrade materials. Actually, maybe I'd find them on these planets. You know, the Amethyst Dawn is. Oh. Hello. Um, thumbnail shot, question mark? Hang on just a minute. Thank you very much. Oh, is this one, like, one giant tower? What is this? Oh, my God. Oh, my God, it is a desolate wasteland. What am I supposed to do here? What the heck? Okay. I mean, it is, it's surely like a small world, so surely there's something. Hang on, is my ultimate peaceful on? Let's get rid of that. See if any enemies spawn. Demon eyes. Hang on, there's a chest in there. Oh god. I hope that's not a bad blizzard. I'm hearing music. You're a black slime. Okay. Uh, okay, chest, 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 chest. 
Prismatic core and a bottle. A bottle? A bottle. Guys, what am I going to do with a bottle? What is... Oh, there they are, look. Here we are. Amethyst Donnies. There we are. I knew it. Okay. So that's why I need to come here, because of these Amethyst Boyos. Alright, so... I needed something from these guys, and I can't remember what it was called. So, once I get enough of these, then I will, uh, I guess, go back and... Yeah? Alright, I got enough, and I got a few of these Mercenaries Aura Sight Weapon Memories now. I already have weapon memories implanted in my weapons, but yeah. 30% increased damage against fighter enemies. What the hell are fighter enemies? I don't know. But I got the banded Tenebrium for the Stellar Glyph. That's it. Obviously, that gives a tier 3, so maybe next episode I'm just going to go into different worlds and do like a crap ton. Because that seems like a good thing to do. And maybe I'll lay it off on lay off the bosses. <laughs> just for one episode. Just do some exploring of many of the worlds. Because this mod is half exploring after all. But anyways, thank you all so much for tuning into this episode. If you have enjoyed them, please do smack a like on it. On the video. And subscribe to the channel. Thank you all so much for making these statue numbers go up. It's very much appreciated. Thank you all so, so much. And I will see you on the next video. Thank you to my members as well, of course. You guys are the best. I'll see you all later. <laughs> Bye for now.